Hey everybody, Josh Tatum here, Tatum Farms. Chicken wants to be in the video in the background. I know I ain't seen y'all in a while. Um, just being super busy with work and everything. Um, I actually I switched companies I was working for about a month ago because the other company work was getting slow and I'd rather work nights and they was put me on some days and some nights and it was really messing with my schedule. So uh, I wasn't able to do videos because I didn't know when to sleep, when to when I'd be going to work or anything like that. So uh, put a damper on doing doing videos. But uh, I'm gonna start trying to do some more. It's still a little hard with the work schedule now. Oh, here past month been working five days on or five nights on, one night off. So it's kind of kind of hard to do a video doing that because working 13 14 hours a night so it don't leave me much home time so uh about the only thing we got going on now is uh being being winter time because uh, we just went from i think we had like two days of fall straight into winter is uh, just feeding so um i'm trying to think on the last time we did a video on what has changed around here um we ended up buying a bull. I don't think I did a video on that, so we'll do one on that when we go to feed. We'll be going over the 20 acres and feeding them. Actually, in the morning. I'm kind of trying to remember what day it was and what my schedule is. So, uh, but our next project is going to be this here. As you can see, there is a lot of chickens in there. And, uh, we're gonna make something more permanent type. That way that run's gonna go out there a little bit more. We're gonna do that here in a, here in a few days. I'll, uh, I'll get uh, one night off. So I'll end up working. The morning I get off, I'll come out here and start working on that. We're gonna put panels up and we're gonna um, put chicken wire on it keep them from going out of the it's just cattle pan is what we'll be using and uh, I got a net order to go on top because uh, they'll end up flying over and our biggest deal out here is uh, hawks hawks like to come in and uh, get the chickens so we'll be working on that let's go down and we'll walk back to my truck I got feeding in the back and uh, we'll get these chickens fed and uh, I got a butcher hog down there somewhere and uh need to get him fed i got him down where uh our pumpkins were so uh and that's another thing i need to do i need to get some hot wire up get him turned out that way he can root around where all them pumpkins were and all them vines he sure loves them vines that the pumpkins grew on so uh got me a group of followers so uh let's go do that and it'll be a short video, but hopefully we'll get back into making a video at least once a week. So that way y'all can keep up on what we're doing here, what's going on, and uh, we'll just keep you posted.
Well, there he is. He ain't very big yet, but uh, he'll grow. Been feeding him twice a day. So he'll uh, he'll put some put some meat on the table here in the uh, springtime. So my plan was getting him this winter that way. All this right here. That's all of our garden area, so uh, I'm going to get it fenced off with hot wire. That way he can go out and uh, root around. Because you can see, kind of hard to see, but all that was, like that there, and a uh, bunch of grass and a bunch of bunch of these here vines from the uh, from the pumpkins. And uh, pig sure do love them, so they'll clean all that up and. Uh, root around turn the dirt for us so hey, that's our that's our plan anyways pot belly pig came down here to to visit him so uh i was hoping to hoping to do some more pigs this year but that's all we're doing right now we actually we bought two of them and uh the other one was a uh, you tell she was a runt and uh, she ended up dying on us. We don't know uh, what happened. I uh, assume worms, because um, she wasn't here on our place very long before she she did die a few days anyway. So uh, we got him wormed, and uh, he's actually he's put on weight since we got him. Um, he was they were a little thin, so uh, uh, I'm pleased with him on how he's doing. Now these goats, on the other hand, you can hear them in the background. They think they're hungry. So uh, we'll go up to the house and we'll get them fed. And they'd go feed them other chickens that I showed y'all just a while ago. So let's go do that. Got them fed. We still have a lot of chickens out. Uh, you may not be able to see them up at the up at the house and a pig. But uh, doing the new chicken chicken pen, new chicken run, uh, we're gonna eliminate all that problem. Right now, it's not that big a deal that they're out. But come springtime, it's gonna be a huge deal. We don't want them getting in the garden or anything like that. So that's one reason we set them out because our garden will be up at the house and uh, then down that way. So they'll, they'll be a little ways from the garden. That way we can turn them out and let them scratch and peck around too. But I'm hoping to give them a big enough area um, to run in anyways that it ain't that big a deal if we don't get them turned out in a day. They'll still, they'll still be fed with grain. So... Uh, that's our plan. We'll see if it works out, see if it doesn't. Um, a lot of stuff that we do doesn't work out, so we learn from our mistakes. At least I hope we do. So uh, let's go up there and get them, get them goats fed. Well, we got all the feeding done. I was wanting to do some more on the video, but 
I had to do a video for uh, me and wife. We've got Country Boy Ministry, so I ended up having to do a video for it for uh, Thanksgiving dinner giveaways. So um, go check out the ministry page. That way, you can keep up with what we do there. I mean, we're that's why it's been so hard to do a video for uh, YouTube because we've been so busy doing doing other stuff between work and ministry. Just just a lot going on, but. Um, I appreciate y'all watching the video. Make sure and keep watching. I promise more videos going to be coming out. So um, make sure and tell people to subscribe. Um, that way you can keep up. We're going to do the chicken pen next. Um, you got to go over and see, uh, see the cows, see our new bull, young bull that we got here. Shoot, we've had him for, hey, probably two months now. Probably right. I think I got him right after the last time I did the last video. So that's how far I am behind. So uh, make sure and stay up to date. And I'm trying to encourage my wife to do some more videos. She's been busy with working. And then, like today, she's getting together all the uh, Thanksgiving dinner stuff or getting in contact with people. So, uh, and she also works full time. So that's what we're busy doing. So make sure you stay tuned with us. Make sure you subscribe. Click the bell to get notifications. And tell all your friends and family about us and we will see you on the next video. God bless.